right it's now seven o'clock yeah, it's still early but so i will be just roaming around and then have my hair cut and then come back here for a checkout i mean take shower first and then check out so for now we are going to go to mcdonald's to eat Look at this bicycle, they just left this bike here and it will be there forever. Yeah, I think it's safe. I don't know, sometimes I'm seeing bicycle without a wheel or without a seat, something like that. I don't know how much safe it is to leave a bicycle in the street. Yeah, but there's still some a lot of people doing that. So that's basically where I stay, that building. And it was on the seventh floor. Yeah, I'm coming back there later to check out. I'm not going apart from this place. I will be just around here. And then I'm going back to Port Stephen. So for breakfast, I had the egg McMuffin, the usual, very common in Dubai and Philippines. For breakfast, yeah, McDonald's and I'm having this coffee yeah <laughs> uh, you know usually I'm having 7-11 coffee uh, which is just one dollar yeah but this one I have this because this is part of the combo the construction of the tram is now in this area yeah this is basically the central station yeah it's very near now but this is just still covered I don't know if they are digging under the, under the street or I don't know but on that side, on the very first uh, uh, place that where they do the digging, it's already almost done. So a lot of people is asking me where to stay here in Sydney, particularly in the central business district area. And I am usually telling them that Haymarket is one of the best places to stay because it's very close, very near to the center. And yeah, this area is the... Hay Market and the Chinatown area. Yeah. If you see that condominium, that one, I tried to look <coughs> for an apartment in there, but yeah, some are nice and some are not really nice because you know, in one room there are like four or five people. Yeah, I don't like that. But the facilities of this building is nice. They have swimming pool, they have gardens, and yeah, nice, nice facilities. Yeah. But you know, some owners are renting their apartment with a lot of people in one room, shared room. Not good. Other side of this, behind this, is already the Darling Hearts, um, Sorry Hills. And yeah, those basically are the place where it's a nice place to stay near to the central business district area. So here in George Street, there is one church. This is a Catholic church. Look at this. There is a Filipino, yeah, a monthly Filipino mass here. Yeah. The barber shop is now open. Yeah, this is basically where I have my haircut. So that haircut is uh, $12 compared to the haircut in sit in uh, Fort Stephen, $35. You know, they are doing the construction, but there are no too much uh, construction worker. So for sure, this the construction will last for a long time. Yeah, I remember when I first arrived here last February, February 2016, this street this road is still clear and possible for all the vehicles and then the day after when i arrived they put the fences and they started the construction so it's now one year and march april may june july august one year and seven months already
notice how much the people here are going to work this time. Very busy. This there is sample here. We will try. Guys, make sure to grab a sample and put a vote on the left. Apparently, taxes are going to be where you vote today. So crunchy on that side, you have a crunchy one there, that's the Banoffee block. There you go, sir. There you go. Let's go for your favourite. Hey guys, make sure you cast your vote smooth or crunchy. Yeah, this is free. Very cold and very early in the morning. So this is basically a uh, yogurt with uh, like a peanut butter. Yeah, it tastes good. They are uh, asking people to choose which one people like. The one with the crunchy peanuts or the smooth one. They fix it already. Before when I was working in this area and the Bavarian beer cafe on that side, they have this already but it was not really like this before. Wow nice. So this is basically the the Royal Australian Regiment Memorial. Yeah, because they help uh, to solve the fight in Korea, Somalia, Afghanistan, Malaya, Iraq, Borneo, Malaysia, Vietnam, East Timor coffee shop is a big business here in Sydney yeah I saw that most of the shops coffee shop they are selling just coffee sh just coffee and some breads and usually they are open from maybe six o'clock until uh, on, until two o'clock in the afternoon yeah last year I was working here and yeah, very near to the Philippine Airlines building that is the Philippine Airlines building yeah you see that those trees ha doesn't have any leaves yeah because of the cold weather but if you look at this one this is still a lot of uh, leaves so this tree is very strong uh, this is the uh, vineyard train station this is actually a new train station so you know what most of the toilet here in Sydney have something like this yeah I don't know what is this yeah, I think this is something like the one for injection to throw here or no, I don't know. Yeah, what's that? Hey, look at this bike, it looks good. Yeah, looks different from the usual one. From that specialized uh, bike, they are, uh, you know, making a special bike. Like, uh, they fit the bike to especially for you. I feel that I really really like the city life. Yeah. I look at that here. There is a bicycle shop. I am going inside to check. Look at this this electric bike. Looks really good. There is a built-in uh, battery. become very much aware about the bicycle every bicycle that I've seen every bicycle that I see I want to take a picture a video So the guy along the way gave me this and yeah I experienced this thing before so the guy gave me and then another guy approached me and asked me if I have the, this uh, voucher yeah and he bring me to one office and in there I did some exam tests about you know personality and yeah and they checked the result of the exam and after that they are offering me something like a, to enroll for 
personality enhancement so that is basically the purpose why those people are giving this kind of yeah favor to attract people to enroll to their course you see this uh, 790 on george i stayed there i stayed there before not the best so i just checked out from that uh, guest house and i would say that that is the best guest house that i have ever been here in sydney i've been to maybe 10 guest house here in sydney and i would say that is the best yeah facilities are nice they maybe don't have a swimming pool or you know gym but it's okay the comfortability of the stay is nice because you know they have a uh, very big lounge with a lot of computers uh, very fast internet connection and the hallway is nice and the room is clean and with a big space the only thing i don't like i would say is that the bank bed they have this uh uh what's that metallic uh, bed which is uh, noisy when you're moving on the bed so that may be the only thing that i don't like but the rest are nice if you can see this one those are some of the stacks the food of the people who are staying here this is basically the kitchen as you can see there are some people there that are preparing their food there are also some fridge and this is the dining area nice this is the like a movie room and if you look at that that is already the central station and you know this elevator is uh, card operated without this card it will not go to the floor that you want to go to i am back here in the palace market yeah the other segment is actually a fruit and vegetable section yeah, of course you can see the fresh fruits and vegetable that are really affordable look at this this is a three dollars and fifty cents uh, bell pepper oh i really like that one that uh, better melon but i don't want to carry that at home <laughs> very far yeah because you know most of these products that you see here you don't see that in the grocery in Walmart or in Kohl's yeah. yeah that's me filipino shop here look they have top silog pork sisig to silog nice look at this this is palabok amazing yeah. <laughs> it's been a long time that i've never eat this uh, palabok amazing So if you happen to be here in uh, Chinatown, Paddy's Market in Sydney, there is a Filipino shop here. I'm very much satisfied with that Filipino food that I just eat there. Yeah, that would be the reason why I came here, but you know, it's good to discover those things. I am supposed to go to this uh, camera shop here. Yeah, uh, this one, camera house, but no more. They're already closed. Look at this. This is another uh, backpacker guest house where I stayed before. The name is Mace Backpacker. And uh, you know, the whole building is, uh, is a guest house. Yeah, upstairs. Yeah, but you know, they don't have a nice lounge, but they have the big kitchen. I saw last time when we stayed there, uh, they have a pre barbecue thing, something like that, in the kitchen. So it's free. Everybody who wants to eat, but if they come that on time, they can have that barbecue. We are now back in the train station and I'm going to catch the bus uh, 241. Yeah, 241. No, not the bus, but the train. I have been walking for long hours. I never get, I never get tired. So now we are going to check which time is it the one that is going to Newcastle. 